Hello and welcome to this video demonstrating the use of SharePoint Business Connectivity Services from within Microsoft Outlook. I'm going to show you how to save emails or email attachments to SharePoint and take advantage of your SharePoint Business Connectivity Services and external content types. For the demonstration, I'll be using the example document library. This particular library happens to contain folders. Within the contracts folder, you'll see that we have three existing documents. The library contains an external data column called Client, and for demonstration purposes, I've created a view called By Client to show some of the additional columns we'll be bringing through from the external system. The external system we are working with today is a SQL database with over 100,000 client records. Let's now switch across to Microsoft Outlook. I will select a few emails and simply drag and drop the emails to the example document library. This is represented as a folder on the left navigation of Outlook. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'll perform a copy to SharePoint. I will select the contracts folder we were viewing earlier in SharePoint. The available content types and the respective SharePoint columns are now presented. This example document library and the selected content type contains a number of columns such as text, choice selection, date, enterprise keywords, an external data column, manage metadata, a lookup column, and a number column. For this demonstration, we'll focus on the client, which is an external data column associated with an external content type configured to point to the SQL database with over 100,000 client records. I will type Fox and either hit enter or select the icon to check if the client exists. In this case, there are multiple matches. I will select show options to present the matches and select the desired client. Alternatively, I could select an item by performing a search across the entire external system. In this case, the 100,000 client records. To help locate the correct client, I can sort or further refine my selection as required. I will select OK and save the emails to SharePoint. The emails are saved in the native format with all email attributes and additional metadata captured. Prior to looking at the results in SharePoint, let's also save some email attachments. I will select a couple of attachments and simply drag and drop them to the contracts folder, now available under the recent locations on the left navigation of Outlook. One Place Mail automatically maintains this list of recent locations for you. For convenience, I'm going to select one of the items already in the library and use the existing metadata as my defaults. This saves me time completing metadata. I will select a different client by simply entering a client number associated with the client I'm working with. If you type an exact match, the entry will be resolved with no further selection necessary. Let's now view the results in SharePoint. Here you will see we have three emails and the two attachments we have saved to SharePoint with the client column populated. If I switch to the client's view, you will see all the additional columns displayed in the SharePoint view. These were defined in my external data column configuration to be populated in the SharePoint view from my SQL database. Of course, without leaving Microsoft Outlook, we can see exactly the same information by selecting the folder on the left navigation of Outlook. This provides full access to the power of SharePoint from within Microsoft Outlook. I will open one of the saved items and you can see the captured metadata, including the client and also automatically captured email attributes. One Place Mail has been designed with performance in mind and simply works with your existing BCS configuration without any additional effort. For example, there is no need to configure external lists and full support is provided for external content type filters. So get started today, integrate with line of business systems from within Microsoft Outlook, initiate workflows and encourage the adoption of Microsoft SharePoint. You can start a 30-day trial of the One Place Mail Enterprise Edition or simply download and start with the free Express Edition of One Place Mail today.